Welcome back to Barbecue with Greg. Let's put that meat on the grill. Let's get started. Well, hello there, barbecue friends. Today, we're going to be firing up the Napoleon Grills kettle here. We're also going to be firing up the Flame Pro. Just get the chill out of the air because it's a pretty cold day. It's around 40 degrees Fahrenheit. We're going to be making some breakfast sandwiches here on the grill. Now I got my only fire cast iron grill attachment that has a nice flat side and a grill side. So it'll be perfect for some bacon, eggs, sausage. So I'll show you what I'm doing. Let's get started. All right, it's been about 10 minutes or so. You can see we got our pellet patio heater well lit, kicking off some nice warmth off of there. I'll probably be standing in front of this most of the time doing the cook here on the kettle. Our charcoal chimney is well lit. We're going to dump that in. We're going to set our center portion of the grill in here. Like that. Okay, let that grill warm up a bit. I got a damp paper towel here as well as some vegetable oil. Just going to spray that on there a little bit. Give that grill just a bit of a cleaning before we start cooking on it. That should be good. Now we're going to start off. I got some frozen hash browns here. Just throw some of those on the grill. Because who doesn't like a breakfast sandwich with a frozen hash brown? Now, I also got some slices of bacon. Because again, bacon's delicious. Okay, and I got some breakfast sausage. Now, breakfast sausage, I mean, it's good in the pan, but this is where it needs to be, right over the fire. Just gonna move these off the center heat there a little bit. I don't want them getting too cooked too quickly. Just gonna keep these sausages moving around the grate here. As this bacon gets closer, we'll move those to the side. Those bacon's way over there. Sausages, we'll just keep rotating those around. Let's put these hash browns front and center. Just 
just to even up our cooking here we'll just do a little rotation Start moving our sausages over to the side here. They're getting pretty done. And put our sausages back here. Okay, see the hash browns are getting pretty close. Now what I'm gonna do, Put a couple pads of butter on there. And we're going to take our hash brown buns. Rub that in the butter. Put some of that goodness on there. Put it on the grill. Throw a little more butter on there. They're an English muffin, well coated in the butter there. I'll put it over the flame, over our grill side. Look at that. Set that aside over there. Doesn't take long. Looks like our hash browns are just about ready. Take these off. All right, put those off to the side there. Now we we'll do our eggs. Now what I got is a couple of these silicon egg rings. Put that on the grill. Put a piece of butter in each. Now I've got a couple of eggs. Crack that open. There we are. I like to just break the yolk like that while it's in the form. Okay, we'll take a plate here. Put two hash browns on there. Take our other plate. Put a couple hash browns on there. All right, these forms have done their job. Pull that up. Pull this one off. What I'm going to do is give these a flip. Another flip. There. Put one on there. One on there. And I got some Mottery Jack jalapeno cheese here. Put some of that on top. One of them I'm going to put my sausage on. One of them we're going to put the bacon. All right. Put the lid on that. Put the lid on that. 
after you're done cooking, you give everything a little bit of a scrape while everything's super hot. Put your lid on. All right, ever since I got this Only Fires cast iron grill for the kettle here, I know it's got that flat side and then the grill side. I've always wanted to do breakfast sausage, do a nice breakfast sandwich, and here we have it. To me, breakfast sausage should be grilled over the fire. Got a couple spare ones here. Mmm. So good. Mmm. Need two hands here. Now I got this beautiful breakfast sandwich with egg, cheese, sausage. Just delicious. Mmm. So good. Oh, can't forget. As well as doing some, well, there's frozen hash browns, but hey, cooked over the grill. Just to complete that breakfast sandwich. And I got to say, this Flame Pro pellet patio heater sure kept me warm standing here. Very nice out here now. Well, if you enjoyed this video, I appreciate you. Smash that like button. You want to see more cooks like this? Click that subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Barbecue with Greg. Thanks for watching Barbecue with Greg. One of those barbecue cooking shows people watch on YouTube sometimes.